All right, so we got Alone in the Dark official making the monsters. Ma huh? Making a what? Let's go ahead and take it. Huh? We, we make it what? Whoa. But what type of spider was that? Did y'all see that little long, the daddy I'm long? I'm Guy Davis. I'm a concept designer and production okay. designer for film, television, and video games. And I was the creature concept designer on the new reimagining of the Alone in the Dark game. Okay. I think everybody has an idea of what scares them in the dark and True. getting to design what possibly is, is crawling around in the dark has always been uh, exciting, especially in, in terms of Eldritch Horror. What's exciting about designing for games is that it's almost uh, creating a creature that has to come more to life than you would for film. Because True. a player, you never know. Is it going to attack him with weapon A or weapon B? Is he going to just run from it? And the creature has to respond in those ways. Oh, he's on fire. The up in here, but it's burning. Of course, he's just seeing these creatures come to life. And, and how the team, you know, really elaborates on the design Ooh, details. That so now you have a sense that the cemetery creatures, cadaver arm, is this, you know, formable weapon that can <laughs> grab, you, say he's, you know, the player. He's in a twist. Use it as a club. He's on fire. The sound up in the, here. The, it's burning. The bayou, he's on fire. The creatures scurrying around in the distance. It's, it's become part of the Boy. environment, which in a lot of ways makes it more real. I'm taking out my Air Force was One, a, a stumping really on those interesting things, character to, to get to work with. He's he's the opposite of like the shambling horror. He had to be threatening, but there had to be something unsettling that you know is behind all that. And what it is is, I think, what will be the most unsettling thing of all. I think it's hard to be scary in this day and age when everything else is so scary. But I oh. hopefully there's something unsettling that stays with you and makes you like you know uh, think twice when you're you're turning the lights off at night what you mean by that y'all think y'all funny Y'all think y'all funny, huh? Y'all, y'all think I know the whole development team. He, he, and then ha ha out there. Y'all sound like hyenas right now, huh? I, I know y'all giggling. I, I chuckling right now. Y'all laughing like it's a comedy show or something like that. Okay, okay, great. Okay, bro, that was such a lame jump scare, bro. I wasn't even expecting it, bro. Bro, the video, bro, the video was over. I was just about to talk. Oh, oh my God, that was so cheap and lame, bro. That y'all, that don't even get. Does, does that count? Does that, does that count as a jump scare? Be real, okay? Don't lie to me. Does that count as a jump scare? I don't. As you know, I'll be real, right? I don't think it counts because honestly, what happened was, um, what happened was. So I said, "Hey, King Indy!" You know, and, and so when they said when they uh when they screamed, King Indy, right? Uh, you know, in my ear, I oh snap! And so that's why I jumped. As a matter of fact, I wasn't even watching the footage. I wasn't even watching the trailer. So how can you prove to me that I got jump scared? I mean, as a matter of fact, you can look at all my videos, all my scary videos, you know, whatever. I never got jump scared, <laughs> never. I, I dare you try to find one. As a matter of fact, if you do find one, I mean, uh, <laughs> I mean, uh, to the lose, I mean, uh, congrats to you. But at the end of the day, I don't think I've ever got scared before in, in neither one of my videos. You know, um, like I said, you can try, you know, um, but it, yeah, I, I've never failed. I've never got scared. I mean, like, as a matter of fact, I mean, I just want to ask you the question. Who gets scared in 2023? I mean, I don't like, come on, man. What type of fool do you think I am? Like, what type of, what type of rookie noob do you think I am of getting scared in 2023? You know, um, oh uh, yeah, I just want to say whoever created that character at the end of the thing that that almost um, that almost even attempted to scare me at the end of the video, 
I just listen. I, I wish you nothing but the best life. But if I ever come across from you, buddy, I want my fade immediately. I'm gonna drop everything that I have just to run my fade with you, right? Because you thought you were so funny putting that at the end of the video. Hee hee ha ha, right? You know, hyenas from Lion King, right? No, buddy, that wasn't funny. Uh, so yeah, I, I want my fade ran uh, at that very second. Um, other than that, looking at everything else, everything else looks pretty cool. These, uh, I'm guessing the the boy. The boy and the girl right here. Oh, no, not him. The boy, I'm guessing the boy and the girl, their main characters. This, uh, I can't lie. Their facial features look really good, bro. Uh, I don't know who she is. I, I don't know. I think she looks, she looks like an actual, like, actress that, like, everybody knows. But I don't know. And then you got this guy looking like, um, like a 1940s gangster. No offense to him. I'm not trying to, like, roast him or anything. I'm just saying, like, he has, like, the whole hat, the vest. You know, he looks like like a gangster type thing. And she looks like some type of, like, journalist or, like, explorer, uh, I guess. But, um, yeah, just looking at the characters, looking at the models, everything like that. Oh, uh, this guy right here, he did a really good job. I'm guessing this is what, I'm guessing this is, like, uh, this. I'm, I'm guessing this is, like, his passion, right? Because he has, like, a lot of scary things um, in his room right now. I can't lie. I wouldn't dare walk in his room. Uh-uh. He got, look at him. He got all types of. What is that? Is that a, that's a casket with, I don't know what's on his face, but that's a casket. I don't know what this thing over here is, but then I think I'm covering it now, but he got this thing right here. I, yeah, I'm covering it. We got this thing right here that looks just like me. Uh, unless y'all actually click on the video, um, the actual video and compare it, that thing looked just like me. That's why I'm glad it's not showing because y'all would have roasted me. But other than that, shout out to this guy right here, man, for, you know, for designing like the monsters and stuff like that for... Uh, alone in the dark and and, and um yeah man I, I always you know obviously all jokes aside I, I appreciate everybody who takes the time out of the day you know to to really do something like this you know especially like if, if you have a passion for it you know um you know they, they take the time out there they, they take hours and hours and hours you know out of the day to like you know to perfect something and to you know share with others I think it's uh pretty cool you know so um shout out to him shout out to everybody you know who put in work for their alone in the dark I think this is I don't think this is the only uh, trailer that we reacted to for alone in the bro. I will fight this bro y'all this fly has been bothering me for videos and videos oh, Bro, I promise you if I catch this fly bro, and and, and you know, I, and I RKO this fly Don't look at me as a as a as a Hall of Fame nuisance. Don't look at me as a, as a as a hazard to humanity Please, please. I'm just it's this fly. It's annoying and I'm ready to just catch it and let it go peacefully But um, other than that, um, yeah, man, everything looks cool. The story looks, the, um, I'll be real. The story looks, um, the story seems pretty scary. Um, but I feel like I can play this game, though. I feel like this is a game that I can play, especially since it's in third person. Third person scary games are not as scary as first person scary games, in my opinion. Um, but other than that, see you guys later for the next I can't talk. But yeah, I'll see you guys later for the next one. I'm out. And um, peace out.